Hi, and welcome to DAC 2010. Today we are going to show a short demo of PowerDRC integration within AWR's Analog Office design environment. Polytita's PowerDRC is a sign-off DRC product designed to handle all designs effectively and efficiently, from the simple to the most complex. For the next few minutes, you'll get a chance to see the PowerDRC runtime flow within the Analog Office environment. You'll also get a chance to see the PowerDRC error browser being used to report and locate DRC violations. Let's go ahead and get started. Here we have a chip layout displayed in our Analog Office window. Let's run PowerDRC and see what sorts of errors we find. As you can see in the DRC run form, you can execute all rules or select any single rules or even groups of rules that you want to run. Clicking on the Configure button allows us to specify the rule deck and set PowerDRC as the DRC tool within the environment. Now we're ready to run DRC. Once DRC finishes, we see a violation list appear at the bottom of the window. Let's investigate the violations. By clicking on these errors in the browser, we are able to highlight and zoom into the specific violations. Notice as we move the cursor over the error highlight, we can see the rule violation text pop up. The error that we start with pertains to Metal 2 only, so we'll turn off all the other layers to make it easier to see what's going on. We can see that the spacing to Wide Metal 2 needs to be at least 2 micron. In this case, there are 6 violations highlighted. But by making the wide metal two slightly less wide, we can avoid these errors. The next error in the list pertains to metal two enclosure of via one. We can verify by measuring that this via is not enclosed by enough metal two to pass this rule. By widening the enclosing metal, we can fix this violation pretty quickly. The final error is a problem with the gate width for a device within a standard cell. Using the ruler, we'll verify that this is indeed the wrong width for the gate according to the rule. So now that we've measured the, uh, the width of this polygon here, we can uh, zoom back out, turn on the rest of the layers. All right, so we'll click on the error again here. display the, uh, the devices once again. Now notice if we double click on the device which is actually within a, a lower level standard cell we can open up that standard cell for edit. So this is where we'll go ahead and fix our device. Um, zoom in and measure again and make sure that we're focused on the right gate and we'll go ahead and stretch that gate to the correct distance and once we've done that we can go ahead and save our fixed cell and so now that we've saved the cell once that's done we can go ahead and run a DRC again similar to how we did before and we can check now and make sure that our design has been fixed correctly and hopefully have no errors. And so if we uh, zoom in here and look in, we see that no DRC violations have been found. So we've fixed everything and the design appears to be clean.
So in summary, PowerDRC is fully integrated into AWR's analog office design environment. PowerDRC provides the ability to quickly execute DRC and locate errors efficiently. For more information on PowerDRC and PowerLVS, please inquire with Polytita booth representatives or sign up for a suite demo. Thank you very much.